runner, Bradness held a few go. Uh, just on the drift, it's out to $2.40. They're just about set. This is race two. They're ready. The mobile starts to speed away. Mako Bay got the best of it. On the outside of it was Mr. Gibson with Express Bomber and out wide Josephine Brook was hooked back. Going underneath them, Virgin Spirit and dropping out last of all is Bradness El Defugo. They run off the back straight here in race number two and Mako Bay in front for Glen Wilmot. Now just going off stride now uh, was the favourite. He's quickly back into a pace though. Express Bomber, Mark Hewitt got him back into a pace and gets go, uh, goes back along the pegs. But we go back to the leader now and it's Mako Bay in front. On the outside in second is Mr. Gibson for Matthew Harris. Moving around them out three wide now to go to the lead. Bradness Fuego for Nathan Turnbull. In a quick move, he's gone to the lead. Back into fourth position now in the one-by-one -one position is Josephine Brook and Robert Clifford. Emma Turnbull has Virgin Spirit travelling on the pegs and Mark Hewitt tacking on with Express Bomber last of all. They're about to make their way into the back. 33.8 the lead time. Another galloper and it's the first start of Virgin Spirit. Back into a pace again but lost a bit of... Uh, ground and the express bomber took a couple of ordinary steps too going into the back straight and he's spotting that second last horse about 15 metres. The leader though as they run down the back is Bradness El Defugo, the late male runner. On its back second is Mako Bay and on the outside third Mr Gibson. Josephine Brooks getting a lovely card into it from express bomber and last of all is Virgin Spirit. 33.7, a dawdling first quarter, and after getting to the lead, Bradness held the Fugos in front. It's got a four or five metre advantage there over Mr. Gibson. Along the inside is Mako Bay from Josephine Brook. In the running line, Express Bomber, and still last of all is Virgin Spirit. They're about to go by the winning post. They've heard the bell. They've got a round of travel. 31-7 the second quarter. 65-4 the half. Bradness El Defugo's had an easy time of it. In second spot on the outside is Mr Gibson and third on the inside, Mako Bay. Josephine uh, Brook is perfectly poised and then came Virgin Spirit and last of all Express Bomber. In front down the back though Bradness El Defugo looking for its second win of having start number five here this afternoon. On the outside is Mr Gibson trying to break the maiden and over on the inside is Mako Bay. Josephine Brook hooks out three wide and commences a run and then came Express Bomber who's just putting in a few ordinary steps on the bend and last of all is Virgin Spirit. On the apex of the bend though in front Bradness El Defugo seems to be travelling nicely Second is Mr. Gibson coming around them, Josephine Brook and Mako Bay on the inner. There you four. In front, it's uh, Bradness El Defugo. He's getting short though. Mako Bay coming with a big run down the outside. Oh, close. They're wide apart. Coming hard on the outside, Mako Bay. Bradness El Defugo didn't want to go straight. May have cost him the race, but hang on to your tickets. A photo for third as well with Josephine Brook and Mr. Gibson. And then we had Express Bomber. And last of all was Virgin Spirit. A tight finish here was coming